Let's go back in time with this gay in history. 1039 Proud FM. On January 5th, 1974, four local dykes attended an amateur singing competition at the Brunswick House Tavern on Bloor Street. Their names were Adrian Potts, Pat Murphy, Sue Wells, and Heather Elizabeth, though they would later come to be known as the Brunswick Four. After performing an original song called I Enjoy Being a Dyke, the women were ordered out of the bar by the manager. They refused to leave, and the police were called. After hours of physical and verbal harassment, three were charged with obstructing justice. Anger grew as the news spread throughout the queer community. A fund for the legal defense of the Brunswick Four was established. The incident sparked a key shift in consciousness for Canadian queers, much as the Stonewall Uprising did in the United States. Toronto's LGBT community began to resist police homophobia and harassment, and the gay liberation movement gained strength. To learn more about Canadian gay icons and history, visit the Canadian Lesbian and Gay Archives at 34 Isabella Street or go to clga.ca.